and about 60 feet across. Here comes your oh wow moment right here as I give you mammoth spring. Check this out. And there goes a bird under the glass. Anybody see him? It's a cormorant. See them swimming? Yes. Told you they swam. Look at him go. <laughs> there he goes. Whoop, that's a fish. But they do, they swim like crazy. And this is man of spring. Isn't that beautiful? What kind of fish is that? Yeah, that's an alligator guy. There's a couple of them down in here. There's a couple of eels, too. They must be freshwater eels, because this is definitely fresh water. Isn't that something? Now, there's another TV show they filmed here called I Spy, and that featured uh, Bill Cosby and Robert Culp. And then, how about James Bond? They made four James Bond movies here. One of them in 1979 was called Moonraker. And with Moonraker, they put these uh, props in the water as part of their filmmaking. And they left three of them when they got done. So I'm going to try to find them for you and show them to you. Um, there's three statues that we're looking for. One side of the boat we'll see them before the other. And then I'll spin it around. Oh, there they are. I came right up on them. They're right there. And... They called them, somebody named them, Poseidon, Zeus, and Hades. And they stand about seven to eight feet high. Let me bring the boat back so y'all can see them. And they've been down in that water since 1979. But they're made out of this wonderful material called fiberglass. And once a month, the divers are clean the bottom of these boats. They also come down and clean the statues because they do get algae on them. Can y'all see them now on the left side? How's that? They're right below us. And folks, before you leave the park, make sure you go into the Discovery Center if you haven't been in there already. They have the creature costume. They have the statues. They also have a huge aquarium with some of the fish in there. But the best thing in there today is Captain Oscar. Captain Oscar ran these boats for 54 years, and he just retired from running the boats a few months ago. Now he's in charge of the Discovery Center. He is the sweetest, kindest man you will ever meet, full of knowledge. So just go in and say hi, how do you do, make his day. He's wonderful. And don't forget the Salt Center. There's 